In some news from the Attorney General's chambers, over the weekend, Attorney General and Minister of Legal Affairs, Senior Counsel Basil Williams, emphasized that the government will respect the rulings of the court on the ongoing elections-related matters. We have to abide by the outcome of those court matters. As you know, President Granger has said that he will be bound by the Constitution, by the directions of GCOM concerning the conduct of the elections, and the rulings of the court. Presently, there are three main elections-related cases in the High Court. These include the case brought by private citizen Ulita Moore to prevent GCOM from conducting a national recount of votes. The learned judge held that he had jurisdiction, and that was not surprising because it was a matter similar to that before the Lord and Chief Justice that was brought by Holodar. And the Lord and Chief Justice there said that the court had jurisdiction to judicially, judicially review the, the actions of a statutory commission or body. That is However, Justice Holder ruled the High Court has no jurisdiction to order GCOM to submit statement of polls to the opposition to the People's Progressive Party. The Attorney General noted this is due to the fact such matters can only be raised by an elections petition, as stipulated in Article 163 of the Constitution. Other cases before the judge include one by the Leader of the Opposition that challenges the declaration of results made by the returning officer which GCOM's Attorney Senior Counsel Neil Boston says is also a matter for an elections petition. For InfoHub, Gavin Lewis. Thank you.